Hello and welcome to Vision Academy. In this video, we are going to convert binary 10100 to decimal. So before we go for converting this one, we have to follow certain steps. So let us write step number one. Multiply each binary digit by its positional weights and the second step is add all the products so now you can consider the given binary number consisting of five digits so you can start counting from the right hand side the position of this zero is zero one two three four so the positional weight of this one is four so first step is what we have to multiply each binary digit by its positional weight so i have to write one into two to the power four next we have got bit zero into two to the power three next we have got bit number one into two to the power two similarly zero into two to the power one next zero into two to the power zero so second step says that add all the products so all of these products are to be added so here i'm going to write plus operator next further we are going to simplify 2 to the power 4 so i need to multiply 2 4 times 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 8 to the 16 so 16 ones are 16 this plus as it is 0 into anything will become 0 hence i'm going to write 0 this plus as it is 2 to the power 2 that is 2 to the 4 4 ones are 4 plus 0 into anything will become 0 plus 0 into anything will become 0 so here we got 16 plus 4 that is equal to 20 so that is to the base 10 that is decimal number so whether this particular answer is correct or not i have to check it out so how do you check it out we are going to go for verification now how do you verify so again we need to convert this decimal number into binary number once again if i get one zero one zero zero then whatever the answer we got in decimal number that is absolutely correct so how to do it so this is the decimal number that is 20 now we have to divide this 20 by 2 and we have to note down quotient and remainder we have to go on dividing this given number by 2 till the quotient becomes 0 so here I am going to write 2 tens are 20, remainder is 0 because here 20 is exactly divisible by 2. So hence remainder is 0. Again 2 is a 2 5 are 10, remainder is 0. 2 2 is a 4, remainder is 1. Next 2 1 is a 2, remainder will become 0. Next again divide this 1 by 2. Here 1 is less than 2 as per basic mathematical rule that says when the numerator is less than denominator then numerator acts as a remainder and quotient will become zero now you can see that the first remainder is called least significant digit and the last remainder is called most significant digit and we will have to write it from most significant digit to least significant digit now you can write one zero one zero zero so which is same as that of the given number Hence, this 20 is absolutely correct answer.